The 7762-S is a specialized version of the 7762. It's still a dual band 802.11 in outdoor access point, but it has a special antenna inside. And we're going to take a look at that. So let's look at some of the details of the Dash S plus take a look at that special antenna. If you remember the antenna from the 7762, this is the first thing you'll notice is different. The Dash S has a significantly different antenna. It is sectorized, and that's what the S stands for, is sectorized. Typically when it's installed, it's actually vertical like this, and what it does is it creates small uh, beams within a 120 degree area. So you're used to a ruckus access point covering 360 degrees with omnidirectional adaptive antennas. This is a 120 degree adaptive antenna. So inside of here, it'll actually create separate 10 degree beams. Now each of those beams has 10 dBi of gain, which is significant, especially out of something uh, so small. So on the end of this access point, we have PoE in, PoE out, so if you need to power some other device, a security camera for example, or maybe a set of ruckus bridges, you can do that with a PoE out here. This has a built-in heater, um, so when you use the PoE in from ruckus, the PoE uh, adapter, injector, from ruckus, you can power the heater, the device itself, and another 802.3 AF device as well. On this end, we actually have a 12 volt input, so if you want to use solar or some other type of power, you can do that. One of the main differences is that this sectorized antenna is 2.4 gigahertz only. So if you want some type of 5 gigahertz coverage, you're going to put external antennas down here. These are two 5 gigahertz antennas, so if you want to do sectors, you want to do some sort of mesh on 5 gigahertz, you do that here. The 7762-S is very specialized with its internal um, sectorized antenna on 2.4 gigahertz. It's really designed for high density metropolitan areas. If you're in downtown New York City or downtown San Francisco and you want to transmit good strong signal to a specific area, um, high gain receive, high gain transmit, this really is the access point for you. With 5 gigahertz on the external antenna, that's more designed for mesh and a little bit less for client access. But this access point is really good when you need lots of gain, farther distances between smaller mobile devices and your access point infrastructure.